Who is the most annoying crew member? No, it ain't the bowsprit people. Nah, I ain't those people who use blunderbums as slapstick, even though you should stop that. Nah, it ain't the people who put items near the helm or the sail adjustment spots. You shouldn't do that, no. Alright, don't do it. It also ain't this guy who collects storage crates like Pokemon cards. All you need is one or two, throw the rest overboard. This right here is the most annoying crew member. No, not that guy, but that guy. This crew is selling their loot, arguably the most boring part of Sea of Thieves. And this guy decided that right now is the best time to check all the notifications, replying to DMs, and basically becoming a useless brick on your crew. Hey, Doonagle, couldn't you have done that while we were sailing to this place? Why the- No, no, I'm not done, get- off of me. Why do you think right now is the best time to reply to DMs? We're gonna log off in five minutes. Do it then. You're effectively AFK farming, you piece of shit. Oh, you wanna come over the moment we finish the faff? Oh, okay. There you go. Now nah, you don't wanna be shooting me. And we're back on Absolute Pixel. <laughs> back up is arriving. Let's see if we can catch yourself a Pokemon. Come on. Come on. Nope. Need an Ultra Ball on this bad boy. Aye. There you go. Oh, we got a Tufa. It's a Tufa. We got a two-man brig. Watch out. In this lesson, we'll learn the basis of most tricks. The Ollie. This is the skating equivalent of a jump. Crouch longer to gain speed and Ollie higher. They got a nuke in their crow's nest. Silly do nagles. You gotta use fire attack on that, because that is always fun to do. There you go. Now, if you at this point wonder why someone would put a nuke in their crow's nest, I suggest asking your favorite Sea of Thieves streamer. Not glare. Wait, the scarecrow found on the dock. It's above the dock to make sure. Wait. And now you know. Hey, uh, do you mind if we help with the fort? We need the completions. That's fine with me. Uh, yeah, you can have the loot, though, I mean. Okay. All right, let's go. Hello. Hello. Hey guys, Fussy Bond here. Today I will show you how to take over a rowboat that is desperately trying to get their loot to safety after we sunk their ship. First thing you want to do is board a rowboat normally. Now you want to take a seat and hope that he doesn't spot you. Alright, we were spotted. Oh, oh. Hey. See me, I'm the best tucker there is. Oh, well. <laughs> Can't just say anything else. Going now. Oh, they're about to sell their Athena. They're here yet? Oh, oh, no. I'll let him pass. He can go. He can go. We don't want that. Yep. That one will take. That one will take. Thank you. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you. Take him! Take him! There you go. There you go. You gotta have standards, pirates. Pirates have standards. Hello. Hello. Can you let me up, please? Thank you. Ha! Okay, I missed that one. Let me take down your ink. Okay, I'll go f myself. Oh, I see you on the wheel there, man. Hold on a second, I'll get you shortly. What? Hello. Hello. All right, Pixels, I need you to check this out. This is awesome. Oh, yeah. 
I just wanted to show you that. It took some time to set up. Uh, let's get a big shout out to Woodrow Jenkins for having an awesome laugh. Yo, Woodrow, can you tell us which cosmetic that under that's under the obstacle that lies beneath Sailor's Bounty comes across the bridge without a few liters of water? Hello. We're about to break Sea of Thieves. How is this even possible? Hello. Hello. Do you want to take this Athena in exchange for all the fortress loot? Sure. Cool. Sith rep, I'm alone on this island. There's another guy alone on this island who's digging up an Athena chest. Now we're just waiting for him to dig it up and then we'll act. And he's dug it up. It's time to act. Come on. Get in that Pokeball. There you go. Come on now. Oh, you're so lunging. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. That's a bad move. That happens. It happens. Let's dispose of the evidence until my boat comes back. There you go. Ow. Oh, snap. All right, the owner of the chest is here. All right, all right, okay. Oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, nah, you can't take it. You can't take it. There you go. Oh, snap. GG to you too, sir. Time to recover the evidence. <laughs> Do you guys think that if we didn't have the internet, we'd still be installing games with CD-ROMs? Or do you think we'd buy USB sticks or SSDs with games preloaded on them? This game makes you ask the important questions. I have a problem. I want to take the dog with me to the top of Plunder Outpost for a reason I don't want to say. But the issue is, is that I can't bring the dog with me in the cannon. See, right now, the dog is probably still on the boat or at the foot of this rock. If anyone has a solution for all this, I will be very grateful. Oh wait, I know who I can ask. Genie, do you know how to get to the top of Plunder Outpost without going further than depending on how you walk your dog for wait and now you know what is going on what is that where do they come from what do they do yeah you guys want to come to the party boat and have fun <laughs> Yeah, I want to party. Let's go party and drink with us. Yeah, I want to party. <laughs> All right, this is party time. Kill me, right? You want me to kill you? Yeah, I need to be dead. You guys party way out of my league. This is too epic. Nice meeting you. Thank you for showing me the ways of the party. I love you. I love you. It's for love. Love you too, man. <laughs> You gotta know your limits. Sometimes you just gotta know your limits.